What does this do? Ow! Of course. Oh man, we are really outnumbered here. Time to bail! Beautiful morning, and I'm still on top of the wood pile. There's so many things I haven't found yet. Why are there so many nails sticking out of these logs? Who just came up here and nailed nails into the logs? What a weird thing to do. All right, we definitely have room for some mints. We use those to make arrows and other, ooh, and a gold tooth. Nice. So far, we're looking pretty good. All right, how do I get in here? Oh, well, that worked pretty easy. Look at me go. I should have really considered making a base inside of the mint capsule. I mean, come on! Who can get me in here, you know? All right, there are a lot of skaters over here beside the baseball and beside that gold tooth that I want. I know I'm gonna get the aggro and I see some science over there. All we can do is knock them out and take the stuff, you know? Oh yeah! Stuff behind. Ooh, a quarter! Now there was one thing that I noticed over here by the nails. Let's go have a gander just to see if my suspicions are correct. Ah, if I use a busty tool on the nail, yoink, I get something from it. Uh, just, just, oh, what is that? There, made some room in the inventory and got some rust. There's like lots of nails over here. Let's go see if we can get some more of that real fast. Nice! We have several pieces of rust. I guess the silver penny nails aren't going to do it for us. Anywho, let's get off the wood pile. Pretty sure we've got everything from over here. Well, we gathered everything we want from the wood pile. No sweat at all. What I need to do now is get over to the field station, evaluate what I have, and head back over to the hose haven to empty my pockets. I'd like to find my way on top of this porch here. I know, we can make a list. First, we'll head over to the field station and evaluate all the stuff we have, rust and termite geek pieces. Once we empty our pockets back at the hose haven, we're gonna make our way back to the upper yard so that we can continue exploring the secrets here, namely, lint. I need lint. After that, we're gonna head back to the Hose Haven and raise the next story of our mushroom castle. Let's not waste any time. All right, our first task is a pretty simple one today. Let's analyze some stuff. First, the termite king. Meh. Next, the rust. Meh. Well, that didn't take long. Uh, let's find our zip line and get the heck out of here. Right, we've got the armor upgraded just like we planned. Now I need to make some upgrade materials with all the things that I found over in the wood pile. While the glue is cooking, the spools are spinning, the grinder grinding, and the cookery cooking, I need to do some upgrading. I might even make another weapon today. Speaking of which, this rusty spear is looking pretty swanky. Level three, gives infection, super fast, and I've got everything it takes. Let's do it. Now for the upgrading materials. Need to make some sturdy whetstones, some sturdy plating, and now some mighty globs. But I think I make those in the oven. Here we are, mighty globs. One, two, three, four, five. I guess those will take forever. Let's check out this spear. Wow, look at this thing. That's what I'm talking about. Now, if we can just get it updated with all the new materials we have, we should be in good shape. We'll have the fanciest stabby thing in the yard. That sounded weird. Here we go. Look how many times we can upgrade this thing. Well, 
Overall, that was a pretty productive night. Now, I still need to get over to the upper yard to collect that lint. I know there's some on the glove, but hopefully we'll find some more. Killing some more ladybirds would be nice as well. For now, let's get some rest. Then we'll head over that way in the morning. Ah, what a beautiful morning. Oh, I guess barring, barring the trash. Woo, all right, let's get out of here. Yes, all right. We made it all the way across the yard without bumping into the thistle. Go me! Now, ladybirds and lint both on the menu this morning. I know just where to go. Now, I remember there being a glove over here somewhere. I found it before. It had lint in it, and we really need that lint to make some extra rope. All right, bag of fertilizer. I think we're getting close. I thought it was over here, but I don't feel any lint here. Hope oh, time to give this a shot. Oh yeah, infinitely better than that other thing. Come on, man, where did I find this glove? Well, in the absence of precision, we're just gonna wander. That can't hurt. Hey, good, a ladybird. Just, oh, and two, nice. Oh, and pupa. Pupas? Pupai? Uh-oh. Uh, I wasn't ready. Red bicycle? Where the heck is this glove? All right, roly polies are pretty harmless. There's an orb weaver, not a problem. Maybe we have to scale the bicycle. Okay, so far this makes a lot of sense. Oh, check it out. We made it to the porch after all. This is great. Man, I've never been up here at all. Maybe we'll find some more nails for more rust. And I guess if we're lucky, we'll find some lint. Maybe there's a glove up here. Why is he angry? Why, why are you guys angry? I haven't seen black worker ants get angry before. Man, the sun went down pretty quickly all of a sudden. Let's have a quick wander around while these ants are angry. See if we can't get our hands on some stuff that's valuable. Somebody did a really bad job at this. Oh wait, that's how I can go up high. The baseball bat. All right, nice. I have to be careful up here because I did not bring the supplies with which to build a campsite. I do have a little food and water, and if I play my cards right, ooh yes, a cookie! If I play my cards right, I should come in and out of here just fine. Man, this place is completely unexplored. I've never been over here. I don't even know what's over here. Is that a coffee pot? All right, what do we have in here? Candy bars, granola bars? Nothing. Here we go. It's small time. Well, that was worth the trip. Let's have a peek right over here before we wander too far up onto the porch. Okay, this is good. Yeah, this is good. I can create a little camp back here right after I kill that spider. And we have everything we need right here to eat and empty our pockets if we had to make some room. Yeah, let's do it. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Sour 
wormhole? Is it candy? I'm not quite done making camp, but I can't just walk past something new. No, the field station nearby. Whoa, 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 what is this? Yo, what is this? Please be open. It's locked. And another entrance to another lab. How do I get in these places? All right, we've got our camp made behind the porch over here. It is very suddenly dark, so I want to go ahead and get some rest before we continue exploring the porch. I found another locked entrance to a lab over there underneath those cylinder blocks, but lint rope is why we're here. We need to stay focused. Ah, what a good morning. Now, I found some of that sour wormhole candy. I'd like to go over here and inspect it real fast and then hop back over here on this porch and get what we need. Oh, it'd be so nice to have some tufts right now. I mean, I've used all of mine. All right, what do we have? Cool, we'll make that stuff later. Oh yeah. Okay, candy, ants, and a ball-peen hammer. None of it looks pretty linty to me. That's a long way down for a guy without any falling protection. But we can be crafty. Yikes, there's a lot of ants over here. The last few of them saw me and attacked me. Stabbing, huh? should about do it. I swear that was like 25 ants, man. All right, if I do all this work and fall through this chair, I'm going to lose my mind. Nice. I mean, climbing our way upwards makes me feel successful. I see another piece of candy over there and a pipe and a radio. Ugh, I definitely needed dandelion tufts and I did not prioritize them. I don't think I can make this jump. Yeah, let's not risk it while we have the daylight. I'm sure there's some good stuff over there, but I am not about to die on account of some lint. Oh, don't die. Woo! Well, it's very clear that there's something on top of that table that I want to get a hold of. But I'm going to have to come back with a tuft, or I just can't get it. Ah, uh, more dust mites. Good thing I... Ow! Good thing I brought the new spear. Stop. Because I'm making short work of these ants, man. And the mites. Woo! Oh, they're everywhere too. Yikes. Wait, is that is that lint over there? Well, did I just did I just stumble into lint? Is that lint everywhere? Stop so I can get my stuff. Okay. Wow, man, these guys see me from like all the way across the world. Ow. What am I even standing on right now? Is this a oh this is a door? This is a doormat! Because that's a door. Stop! Sheesh. Let this be a lesson in wiping your feet before you go inside anywhere. Okay. Yes, the good stuff. Let's get some more. Yep, that's all of it. 
Okay, so this place gets shadier much faster than other places. I guess because the sun is blocked by the shed. But there's a lot of stuff over here that I haven't seen yet. Just gotta get away from the ants. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. What? Man, he came all the way up here? Are you kidding me? Oh, I guess we'll just walk through the hose. And whoa. What the heck is this? Are we in a flower pot? Man, it sure is pretty in here. What is this? Orchid mantis kebab? No. This is another dwelling place of a terrible insect. Oh, we have to come back and figure out what that is. But first, gotta find the recipe. For now, let's make our way out of here. All right, don't have time to fight the ants. I got some running space. Hey, look, a ball. What is, I don't wanna, okay, I don't wanna fall down there, but what does this do? Ow, of course. Man, we are really outnumbered here. Time to bail! Okay, I think I lost them. But man, all I found up here was the lint, which really is a win, but I've gotta come back with tough so I can make these jumps and explore those other places. Watch out, man. All right, we made it to the bike tire camp with very little damage taken. I did have to jump a few times and it wasn't pretty, but we made it. Let's get a quick rest and we'll head back to the hose haven where we'll regroup. And then we can start laying out the next foundation for our base. Oh no, I stumbled upon this guy. Maybe I can get around him without having to encounter him. I'm low on food and low on energy. Uh oh. How about that? Still got it. Man, what the heck is this? Is this the mushroom I planted earlier? Holy smokes, look at this thing. Wow. Just, uh... Just made away, huh? I'm building my house out of this stuff. Let's get it. Well, I think I have the next phase of our build all laid out. First, we'll start with the mushroom door and then go around the balcony on the second floor followed by the pillars and the balcony for the third floor. Then we have to finish building the walls and the upper mezzanine, including the acorn spiral staircase right there on the other side. I've probably got enough mushroom bricks, but I definitely don't have enough weed steps. Let's see how far we can get. This place is a banger. Something worthy of showing off. Let's have a quick look. The first thing you can see is this awesome acorn door. On the second story, we added pillars, lights, and an acorn fence. On the third story, we added all of our storage and then lights at the very top. On the next level, we went ahead and finished the floor with the weed stems and the burr sides. 
I figured if I can get this high enough, I can get on top of that porch right there and explore what's up there. There may be nothing, there may be something, who knows? But overall, we were really successful today in getting everything we needed. Let's recap. First, we identified a few things that we found right outside of the wood pile. Second, we found lint and a bunch of it. We didn't find it on the glove like we had planned. We found it on the doormat by the shed. And lastly, we got so much more of the base put together, including the fourth floor. We sure did burn through a lot of resources in order to do this, and I still have some organizing to do. This place is starting to come together, but I've got to make sure that it stays uniform and stays looking good. This is where I live after all. Next time, we may have to prioritize our efforts and try to find whatever it takes to summon that orchid mantis. I don't know how to cook any kebabs, but I'm sure there's someone out there who does. There's always work to do here in the yard.